why don't 90% of East Asians get sick from milk? The answer comes from a 10,000 year old innovation. Like all mammals, humans feed milk to their babies because it's rich in nutrients that help them grow. And one of the valuable ingredients of milk is a sugar called lactose. Babies can't absorb lactose directly, so they need an enzyme called lactase. This enzyme breaks down the sugar, allowing the baby to absorb and use it. But here's the thing, mammals don't drink milk once they grow up. So producing lactase in adulthood isn't really necessary. That's why most mammals stop making it after childhood. If you drink milk without enough lactase, the sugar stays in your gut and gets eaten by microbes, which produce gas and other byproducts that can make you feel sick. That's what we call lactose intolerance. But around 10,000 years ago, humans started domesticating animals. And one of the byproducts of this was milk. This was a new source of energy, but only for babies since adults couldn't digest it. However, around 7,500 years ago, a genetic mutation occurred that kept lactase production active throughout life. People with this mutation could digest milk as adults, which gave them an extra source of energy unavailable to others. Today, 65% of adults are lactose intolerant, but the numbers vary widely between regions. For example, most people with Northern European descent can drink milk easily, but 90% of East Asians are lactose intolerant. That's because dairy farming never became a major part of their ancestral diets, so there was little evolutionary benefit to keep lactase active after childhood.